Running back Melvin Gordon for the Denver Broncos was let go from the team last night. The decision was mainly made due to this fumble right here and all the fumbling problems Melvin Gordon has had throughout his career, especially this season as he's fumbled five times through ten games. Melvin Gordon's fumbling problem isn't new as last year against the Chiefs, Melvin Gordon had a terrible fumble resulting in a Chiefs touchdown. I mean, these fans' expressions say hit all. They're in disbelief of what they just saw. Then also in last year's season against the Raiders, it's a tied game late in the second quarter, Melvin Gordon fumbled in his return again for a touchdown. Then during the post-game press conference, Melvin Gordon left mid-question because he was tearing up and crying because he felt so bad about fumbling. A game like this and the, and the fumbles out of your mind so you can get right for Thursday? Uh, you know, I have to for the team, you know. I care about them boys more, you know, than I do, you know, any fan, any person. You know, especially when we out there because it's just us. Um, you know, I make a mistake. First guys over there, the, you know, cheer me up and get me back right, you know, um, them boys believe in me, um, uh, I just got to do better. Melvin, you mentioned a couple of days ago that you were doing extra work on uh, ball security on the practice field, so like, how frustrating is it that, you know, you put the extra work in and it still happens? But it doesn't seem Melvin Gordon cares that much anymore because last night after his release, he posted this on Instagram. He put himself behind the wheel of OJ's car chase and then dissed the Broncos fan base as he said, boy, y'all's fans was hell and said, let's laugh on the way out. Also, Melvin Gordon wasn't like a terrible running back by any means. He played in 10 games this season, starting six of them. He was averaging about 30 yards per game on nine attempts and had two touchdowns in the year. Just the stinger is he had five fumbles and only 90 attempts. This is the play that led to the ultimate fire of Melvin Gordon, though the Broncos are taking on the Raiders both teams are struggling. The Broncos have a three-point lead and there's only 34 seconds left of the second quarter. The Broncos have the ball on the three and need one yard for the first down. Melvin Gordon's lined up to the left of the quarterback in the backfield, gets the handoff, takes the ball, gets the first down, but then fumbles the ball before the end zone and the ball is recovered by the Broncos about seven yards back. This took away an easy first and goal opportunity for the Broncos and then the field goal was blocked just a few plays later. The Broncos ended up barely losing this game in overtime to the Raiders and the Raiders have three wins this season two of them coming from the Broncos. That's going to be the end of this video. Leave your thoughts about Melvin Gordon in the comment section down below. And if you enjoy my content, I would really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. And once again, thanks for watching.